One of our research projects at the Center for Empirical Social Research at Corvinus University is uh, called Mediatized EU. This is a seven country project uh, which focuses on how the European integration is perceived by the elite, the media and the public. During these projects we met uh, uh, an interesting professional challenge. But let me start with a, with a personal note. Back in the 80s, uh, when I was a younger scholar, uh, my late boss Rudolf Andorka encouraged us to apply for international grants and take part in international cooperative projects as much as possible. We learned that it, that it is meaningless to apply just for the sake of application or of prestige, but if we find something professionally challenging or interesting. It is worth to do that and it is worth to, to act fast and, and cooperatively. So we have done so and, and since the 90s we have been involved in several international projects. These have looked at the uh, attitudes of the elites and uh, the public uh, concerning uh, the EU and other um, social issues. Uh, it would be damaging if such projects uh, were to be permanently discontinued in our country. Especially young, talented Hungarian researchers uh, would suffer. But it would be uh, damaging for the international research community as well, because they would lose an interesting point of comparison. So, most recently, uh, we joined a, a rather peripheral team of small universities, small countries, uh, but uh, uh, with the, with the Peace of mind of the underdog. We applied, uh, and this team managed to to write a good proposal and win support from Horizon 2020. So the topic is clear, uh, and we applied several several mixed method approach. Uh, we have uh, we, we had a, a rather extensive content analysis and discourse analysis of the media. Uh, we have done elite interviews, uh, political and media elite interviews, getting more and more difficult to do that, but we, we, we succeeded to do uh, with the Q methodology. And also we have done a public opinion survey. Among others, we, we found that uh, 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 the trust in, in, in institutions is very low in, in Hungary, in international comparison. Uh, but uh, uh, within this low level of trust, uh, people trust more in EU institutions than Hungarian ones. Also, we did find that uh, there are differences uh, in, in terms of the approaching the, the integration, the support of integration. The general public is more supportive than the governing elite at the moment. Uh, and the professional issue. The professionally interesting thing in, in this aspect is that obviously there might be uh, mm, substantive reasons behind that. Uh, ideological behavior aspects. But there might be also methodological reasons because elite interviews differ from, from public opinion surveys of Likert scale questions, Likert scale uh, type of questions. So we uh, our effort is to try to separate the reasons. We still have to wait for the results, but those who are interested in can visit time to time our website, uh, mediatize.eu, or the website of the Research Institute, uh, the Center for Empirical Social Research at Corvinus, and listen to our podcasts.